<clears throat> yes, I met David at the right time. It was just, I actually met him before I took his class, about two years before, and I wanted to take the classes so badly. But somebody was looking out for me because I didn't <clears throat> take him then, and I don't think I would have gotten what I got two years <coughs> later. I was ready. And uh, with uh, his techniques and the information and the pushing the buttons in me that he did, he made it possible for me to enter into the musical theater as well as uh, the uh, dramatic theater <laughs> <laughs> that I was in before. And uh, now, many years later, I have entered into the fantastically financially rewarding world of cabaret. <laughs> <laughs> first really big reward, other than just the fact of it from David, was to get to play Eve Harrington in the musical of All About Eve called Lost. <laughs> now, we were in tryouts in Detroit. At this point, David and Nancy had decided to move to California, and David had his flight all planned to go to California permanently when he realized that he wouldn't be in New York when I finally got to open in my own show. So on his way to California, he rerouted re his plane, or thing, what, what do they call them, triangles in those days? And he went to Detroit to see me in my first new show. My daughter was about to go to college, and I decided that that was the time for me to come home to New York. So. We, I gave up my house in West Hollywood, and uh, that summer, before she left and I came back, we lived in David Craig's um, guest house. And that was the summer <coughs> that we made the cassettes that have now become the DVDs. And I would watch him go out in the morning to make these things knowing, of course he was always you know, grumpy about it, but knowing that he was putting this down for us all to have forever. Thank you, mm -hmm. David Craig. Mm -hmm. <laughs>